The Training Wheels of Love by Mimi Pond. After three months of lovey-dovey goo-goo bliss, he turned into the mood monster. I should have turned tail and ran when he confessed, I loathe myself. After breaking up with me, he came crawling back, lured me on a picnic in the nearest park, which happened to be a cemetery, brought a bottle of wine, and seduced me behind some headstones, which is how I wound up pregnant. He said he couldn't come with me for the abortion, Gotta work. but he made it up to me by showing up on my doorstep after I came back from the abortion, wanting to watch the World Series. I wasn't even a baseball fan, but I let him in. I chose to ignore the signs. It wasn't until nine months from the start of this doomed romance, after he forgot both Christmas, oops, and Valentine's Day, oh, about that, that I finally got the hint. After I broke it off, he wanted to be friends. I told him, You don't deserve my friendship! <laughs>